haven't had as much time on the sticks as others, so hopefully they can adapt as quickly as possible. It's definitely going to come down to those my games. And here we have Black Mamba with Hitomi EMP. Looks like he's got himself a sponsor against UBW Gun Jack. Yeah, I believe EMP is for uh, Empire Arcadia. Oh, is that why I saw the Empire Arcadia guy? Here I we saw go. Earlier. Here we go. We're seeing actually some very good play out of uh, Black Mamba here, of course. You know, he's doing all the correct punishment. He's definitely spacing, but unfortunately didn't space correctly enough and got hit low on Kasumi's wake up. But Mamba is there we go. That was perfect spacing from Mamba. Oh, Ooh. one more hit. Don't unfortunately, he whipped and oh. grabbed and stopped blocking there on the spacing. He Oh, that was a big mistake by Mamba. You know what? He seems to be a little nervous. You know, I can imagine he is. It has been a long time since he's tried playing DOA. Yes, and this is a whole brand new DOA for oh, him. Oh, here we go. Critical break. Oh, oh and he charged it up for too long. Unfortunately, he did. Remember, you know, of course, you know, he can't get off that power blow if he's not below 50% life. No, it will just do... A, does it stun them or does it also damage them? Um... What happens if they're not below 50% and you if, get hit with the power blow? You kind of just get a regular stun. It's not going to do that unholdable animation. And just a tiny would. bit of damage, or it'll, it'll do you know it'll do a good chunk of damage, mm -hmm. but it's it's not going to give you the the primary benefit, which is the unholdable stun. Ah. All right, well, here we go. Black Mamba is now coming back. It is one to one. This Kasumi player definitely, wow, that was a very good counter by that Kasumi player. He definitely doesn't seem to be that bad at this game. Oh, here we go. Another critical break. That was a great critical burst there, and Mamba took great advantage of that digging. Oh, that was a good chunk of health. Oh, man. You know, if Mamba can keep this up, you know. Oh, perfect spacing by Mamba once again to push. Oh, my God, this is great play. We're finally seeing what we were talking about. Mamba is putting it out there. He is now in the lead two to one. Yeah, Mamba's got excellent whip punishment here and another oh. critical burst. Wow, here critical we go. Critical burst to a wonderful launcher to finish off the nice eight hit combo. He's got Kasumi up against the wall here. She can't do anything. You know, I see he's not fully maximizing his potential off of those combos, but he is setting up a situation that he is taking advantage of it. He is definitely understanding what he is doing now. He seems to be way more comfortable now and taking that three to one. What is Gunjack going to do? This is Mamba he's playing against. All right, they're just going to reset the system real quick here, folks. No problems. But, uh, wow, I, it, it is so refreshing to see this. I, I've been waiting for this. Mm -hmm. uh, the mustache is, ma mustache is here. The guy on the left, what a wonderful mustache he's got going. And Mamba sporting one now, too. <laughs> All right, and here we have Hitomi versus Tina. Looks like Mamba is going to once again pick Hitomi. And, you know, I, I think that guy was kind of disappointed in his Kasumi play and has now switched over to Tina. Yeah, it seems like uh, he's, he's probably a little bit panic-struck by uh, Black Mamba here. He is a really intimidating person to have to fight against. You see those mustaches I was talking about, Rakuda? <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> and oh, if yes. you notice in the back left, that is actually Alex Vaya. For any of you that know the fighting game community, he is a high-level Street Fighter player. And, you know, it's great to see him here at the DOA booth because... I, I really want to see the Street Fighter crowd come over and try out this DOA 5. Yeah, I mean, Street Fighter is the most popular of uh, fighting games, pretty much, uh, unless you count Marvel, of course. Mm -hmm. But uh, it, it's always nice to see, you know, some of those uh, sure you can guys cross over into these other fighting games yes it is and black mamba is coming out with the fierceness taking you know he's really good at spacing do you notice how he just gets out of the range just right at, at the right time so that he can take advantage of when his opponent whiffs yes and you know a lot of characters have had uh, improved back dashes and just moving across the board in this game and it, it's it's showing here you know if you were good at spacing in other games you'll be good at spacing in doa5 because it has much much improved movement over DOA 4. Well, definitely coming out of Mama, he had two grabs there. The opponent definitely had to attack so he wouldn't get grabbed for a third time, but that actually caused him to lose because Mama is just delivering the punches to the face. He's not giving much breathing room for Gunjack here. Is there anything Gunjack could do to come back from this? It's going to be hard. I mean, this is <laughs> fighting against Mama. He's like trying to fight against the truck head on. It's not going <laughs> to work out in your favor most of the time. <laughs> well, perhaps if that truck wasn't moving at 60 miles an hour like Mamba seems to be here with Hitomi, he would have a better chance. <laughs> but nonetheless, Mamba taking that win with almost 95% health shows you how he doesn't even get 